After two days of deliberations at the summit in Nairobi, members of the Kenyan and Nigerian business community have concluded that there are huge potentials for the two economic giants to speak with one voice and East African sub-region working together. The wish of the business communities is that if we could have a free movement of goods, services and labor, that will be the ideal um, situation. Instead of us focusing our energy on ban list, why don't you look at providing some bilateral agreement between the two countries uh, to create some kind of duty-free zone between these two countries. President Muhammad Ubuari enjoined participants at the forum to ensure that business relationship between Kenya and Nigeria continues to strive by making the right policies to break barriers. I doubt if it is yet Uhuru for our prospective business people who still encounter some business restrictions as well as registration of their businesses. Our business people should be allowed to operate within the ambit of law unimpeded. I also urge you to fully embrace partnerships and cooperation in the search for answers to our economic growth, development and prosperity. President Bwari is also of the view that with the falling oil prices, the only way for both countries is to break even and compete favorably in a growing competitive global environment is economic diversification. The focus of the administration necessitated by the present stark reality is diversification with focus on agriculture, manufacturing and infrastructure development. President Uhuru Kenyatta believes that strong partnership between Kenya and Nigeria has the capacity to fast track the desired integration of the African continent. I look forward once again to working with my brother to see how we can establish a special status agreement between Kenya and Nigeria that can drive the integration of the West African economies and the East African economies. And I think this would go a long way. President Buhari's visit to Kenya was rounded off with a state banquet in his honor by President Uhuru Kenyatta. Patience, Usayomabo reporting.